Hey guys, how's it going? I'm going to show you how I'm farming my legendary items. So my aim is for, you know, perfect or close to perfect rolls on my aspects. I still have some aspects that have the lowest possible roll because I am very unlucky with the things I drop. Um, I'm aiming for, you know, starlight aspect that gives me resource when I heal 25% uh, of my life, for example. I still have a very bad roll there. But anyway, so the way I farm legendary items is by doing the Vampiric Siphon Challenge. So this challenge can be found randomly in the Vampiric Zone, the green zone from Season of Blood. And as soon as we interact with this statue, as you can see in the middle of the screen, a uh, red circle will appear and then you have to stay within the circle. And the longer you stay, the more rewarding it gets. But the harder it gets as well, not only because Elite Vampire starts to spawn, but also because you start to take a lot of damage over time and this damage it gets you know into a very high degree per se like maybe 10 percent of your hp per second even more and uh it, it's really tough if you don't have a way to sustain your life so this only works if you have a build like my build for example that has uh many ways to uh, mitigate the damage over time you are taking by either having life steal are the vampiric powers in which you can use in any build. So my biggest tip actually is to use the two vampiric powers for this challenge. The first one, uh, it, I actually don't know the name, but I know what it does. So uh, it heals you for 3% HP for each skill you cast. And then 3% more HP if you are under 50% life. So that is pretty good. And the second vampiric power, it gives you uh, one percent damage reduction for each two percent life you are missing so those two vampiric powers are really good to do this challenge and it can be completed by the way i've seen many people do it and then they leave after like 15 seconds or so but if you stay the full way you can actually get even more uh, spawns of the special elite vampire there is a special elite vampire that always drop a guaranteed legendary and so the longer you stay here uh, the more of those vampires will start to spawn and uh, my, you know, my record so far was like uh, 12 legendaries to drop in this challenge, but not always it's 12, sometimes it's 6, sometimes it's 8, but it's nothing less than 6, I'd say, if you can fully complete it, of course. And my builds can do it, so if you are interested in a build like this, I'll link it in the description. And uh, yeah, so now I'm going to show you the challenge. And if you enjoy this method, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe. I'll see you guys then next video. Thanks for watching.